Hey, hello everybody, welcome back. Dude, it's Magic. Magic. Uh, this is a continuation of the unboxing that we did last Saturday, so if you haven't watched that, I'll link it. Um, oh, also, this, this has nothing to do with Magic, but uh, YouTube's getting rid of annotations pretty <gasps> soon, so uh, we're going to have to switch up a little it. bit of our content for that. Yeah, the old ones at least stay, but Yeah, I'm just going to yeah. get rid of them. But I, I, don't, I, I personally don't know why they would remove it in general, but... It is a little weird. Like, I, I get if, you know, you want people to move over to the card system or something, but why get rid of functionality that, I don't know, that they don't have anything to replace it really exactly with, so. Anyway, that doesn't really matter. Uh, <laughs> so, we're playing Super Sealed, uh, Modern Masters 2017, and I believe I won the money you, thing. You kind of, uh, rolled. Yeah. Yeah. I that. mean, to be to be fair, the box was pretty suboptimal, so rolling... But you had the majority yeah, that's true. of that, too. I had over $100 of value, so I guess that's something. So, I'll be going first, and we will see you in game one. All right, game one. I will show my hand. So, I am playing a uh, Nea Colors. It's kind of a token-y deck, but it's, it's more or less just, like, kind of valuable stuff in Nea. So, that's what I've got. Go ahead. And I am playing Naya Colors. <laughs> Far more uh, token-based, though. That's what we've got. Whoop. You can turn around. Okay. So, I was actually deciding what to do here. Um, so many options. Kind of is. I think it would be more prudent... To lead with a jungle shrine and pass the turn. Draw for turn. Guild gate. Here we go. Unzap. Draw a card. I'm gonna play a snow covered mountain. Cast explore. So, draw a card off that. And I'll play an extra land this turn, which will be foil snow covered forest. <gasps> and cast Avison's Pilgrim. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Got a pretty rampy hand. Looks that way. We're gonna go for Call of the Conclave. All right. Get ourselves a centaur. The first of the opening salvo. Enter go. Unzap. Draw a card. Well, that's Duplication City apparently. Um. Explore. Draw a card. That's decent. Snow covered mountain. Only one land though, sadly. And then, hmm, I will attack you for one. <gasps> Why is that just the most suspicious of things? When you could potentially <laughs> have magma jet mana open. I will take it. Okay. 19. Um... One, two, three, four, five. It's kind of a waste, but I'll take it. Burning Tree Emissary, and I will Magma Jet your face. Because I want the scry. 17. Normally, you would not want to waste a, a burn spell, but your deck is mostly 3-3s, three so... Yeah, Magma Jet doesn't really do much. Yeah. The <laughs> Go ahead. Untap. Rough return. Perhaps I should have done that before exploring, but I wanted to see if you would. Forced. Do. Three. Let that happen. I will go to 17. And. Call of the Conclave. Alright, another one. <laughs> How many of those did you open? Four. <laughs> Oy. I opened a good draft deck. Yeah. Not so much value. Mm hmm. And sure go. Unzap. Draw a card. Well. Something. Granted, mm -hmm. Super Sealed has double the packs that you would in a sealed deck, so... Yeah. They're a little higher quality. Attack for two. Hmm, that makes it pretty suspicious. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll block it. Okay. Pew. Scry two. Definitely, Definitely, I don't think I need that. Well, yeah, I don't think I need that. Top bottom. And I will also make a dupey centaur. <gasps> so many centaurs. 
I didn't. I don't think I have nearly as many of these as you have. I think I've got two, maybe three. I think only two though. Anyway, pass turn. Untap. And if you want tokens like these, not this specific one, you can uh, head on over to store.forestbear.net. Drop turn. Land. All the proceeds for that will help uh, Mr. Boopster pay for his plastic surgery. He wants a nose. He wants a nose. So, so you know, he's got to got to raise some funds so that he can get a nose. I mean, he doesn't need a nose though. Well, I mean, with really, that, with that great intellect. Well, okay. No so, one will look down on him. So, so honestly, we're just gonna take the money. He's not gonna get it, <laughs> but he thinks he's gonna get it. Ah, yeah. He so he's gonna get the money, and uh, you know, makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> Three. <laughs> you probably have another one. <laughs> um, I'll take three. Go to fourteen. Enter go. Oh, you don't. Interesting. Draw a card. Three. Some eyes in the sky. Ah. So I'll make a bird. Yeah. We don't have one one bird tokens. We have we two have, twos. We have two two swans and they're birds. So it's like the same thing. Yeah. And for the populate, uh, he's a center. Okay. Block. Sure. Death to men. Here's a thrag task. Gain <sighs> five life. Go to 19. That's a big boy. It's foily, too. I use <laughs> foily. So, so pretty. Not worth as much as I thought he would have been. He's almost worth nothing. In fact, I kind of want to get our foil playset just because of how worthless he is. Anyway, go ahead. He used to be so good with Restoration Angel and Standard. Yeah. Now he's... Druff turn. Well, and I think this is his first reprinting, other than weird, like, Commander or whatever products. Yeah. I don't think he was in any... He wasn't yeah. in, like... Yeah. Actually, I don't really remember him being in any of those either. It was just the one core set. It was a core set. Was yeah, it was. Yeah, it was a core yeah. set. Right. So the one after Abyssin Restored. Yes. Forest. And... Hmm. Here we go. Untap. Draw a card. Okay. Snow covered mountain. Hmm. Attack for five. Block it. Okay. Just just like that? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no fanciness. I was I was expecting some fanciness. Uh, got a beast here somewhere. Beast. Go ahead. Druff turn. I was actually expecting another eyes in the sky. Yeah, that would have been a nice forest. Enter go. Hmm. Interesting. Draw a card. All right. I'll take it. Attack for three. Take it. Go to 14. Call the Conclave. Go ahead. Draw for turn. And does something. Something's always good. Revive. All Came right. back. Call of the Conclave to my hand. Yep. Call of the Conclave. You got it. And <laughs> so many of these. Forced. <laughs> sure go. Unzap. I think that's all the forces. Draw a card. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> um. Six. Centaurs will do battle. Deal. Eleven. Here's a Selesnia Gilgate. And I'll pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Everson's Pilgrim. Yep. Enter go. Untap. Draw card. We almost have like a weird parody going on. <laughs> um, let's go for a voice of resurgence. Ooh, just in case you want to cast something during my turn, I'll force you to do it now. And I'll attack you for three. Eleven trumpet this time. Okay. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Here go. Untap. <laughs> Draw a card. See, the thing is, I have no idea what you're drawing, because... 
I guess just lands, but you missed some lands, like earlier. So I'm not. It just seems so weird. Well, whatever. You, you can find the answer if you look at what I have for lands. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm just missing a whole color. Uh, yeah, I forgot your uh, <laughs> three colors. Tech for five. Six. I'll keep Pilgrim untapped just just because of funds. Um. Then. We'll go for Harmonize. Draw three Ooh. guards. Okay. Mm. Is it worth it? Sure. Wayfaring Temple. And a Selesnian Guildgate for land. Good. Draw for turn. Apparently someone's making a phone call. You can probably hear that on camera. Call of the herd. Hey! An elephant. Don't need red for that. Flash it back. <laughs> Just make a couple of doodages. No, Intro. Right? Untap. Draw a card. Okay. Attack. With all of these men. Block. 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 Okay. So, three. Go to three. Voice dies. Get a Fuski. This that dies. dies. And these trade. And... Um... Explore. Oh, right. It's not my yeah, first it's not, card. It's not your first card. But it doesn't matter. Cause you got the mana? I got the mana. 5D. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. A, lot, a lot of red stuff. He could have cast that. I could have, but... Yeah. Yeah. It was just gonna be a four four attacking. <laughs> and I meant and I was at nineteen, so it's right, not that double uh, way through there. It's a nice it's looking, a looking mountain. Down. It's a nice looking <laughs> mountain. <laughs> Alright. So that was game one. And then we'll see you in game two. Alright, game two. Go ahead. Just get this gunk off the table. We've got Most importantly a red source. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop. It's a good thing I didn't play that Blood Moon that I opened. <laughs> that would have that uh, been pretty good for you. So, taking a bit of a risk with this one. But uh, I think it might pay off if if it comes in. And apparently we're getting phoned again. <laughs> All right. We're going to play a mountain. Hey. Turgo. Also a very nice looking mountain. Really? I didn't even know I had that many of these in this deck. Okay. So let's need Guildgate. Go ahead. <laughs> Draw turn. Forest. And a Sylvan Ranger. Yep. Eh, won't have any color problems this time, I don't think. Oh, let's find nice looking planes. A thunderstorm one. Okay. Does that feature a, a gentleman? Is there a gentleman on there is a gentleman on there. But more importantly, there's Under a thunderstorm. The yeah, and he's holding a stick, so he's probably going to get fried. And not the good kind. Not the kind you do on a Friday night. Enter go. Untap. Draw a card. Well, okay. Slesnia Guildgate. Go ahead. Untap. That's really unfortunate. Draw for turn. Planes. Attack for one. I will take one and go to 19. Gonna make a Fusti. And call the Conclave. Yep. I, I kind of just assume that when, whenever you tap those colors. There we go. I think it's a pretty uh, pretty good assumption. Well, that's fine. Expose. I'm having this problem you had last game. No reds. <laughs> Selesnia Gilgate. Wow. <laughs> go ahead. You win so many of your colors. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I did not know I had that many. <laughs> I really didn't. Draw for turn. Um, let's 
go for a Sylvan Ranger. Yep. I could use one of those. <laughs> Too bad I don't have any in the deck. Seemed like a pretty good card. Yeah. This one also find a planes. I used Explorer instead of him. I had a few of them, but... Yeah, I chose these yeah. and Avacyn's Pilgrims. Well, especially because I am running the uh, Crater Hope Behemoth that I opened. So I figured ramp in that sense is probably a little better than fixing. Yeah. Even though Explorers is only sometimes ramp. And forced five. Yeah, I think I need this Pilgrim around, so I'll go to 14. And once again, <laughs> another Fusti. Call the con clan. Another Fusti. Okay. That's why the phone's always ringing. Yeah, apparently. Keep calling them. Trigo. Ring a ding ding. Fusties. Draw a card. Well, that that kind of works. That kind of works. The tapped red source. Uh, yes, <laughs> it is. Jungle shrine. Um. Okay. So then this turn. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. Burning tree emissary, <gasps> kind of a red source. It is a red source. Make a make a green and a red, and then I'll also make a white and a cast a woolly thokta. <gasps> big big stinky boy. He's a big boy. Pass the turn. Untap. Big stinker. Draw for turn. I mean, he's probably gonna get ground assaulted, but hey, planes. Did I call it? You called it. Ah! Ground assault him. Jesus. <laughs> Ground's just not friendly for him. But he's my boy. <laughs> and six. Mm. I really don't want to take it, but I'll take it. Go to eight. Wake the reflections. Uh. <laughs> Centaur. Yep. Oh, that one just populates. Yeah, I thought, that one just populates. For some reason, I thought that was the bird one, but no. that costs four. Enter go. Okay, untap. Draw a card. That's not terrible. Um, It's not terrible. Um, hmm. You have a lot of damage on board, though. So I think because of that, I have to do this one. Drag Tusk. Gain five. Go to 13. Try and keep in this somewhat. Go ahead. Untap. Even though he just trades for a dupster. I mean, he'll trade for two dupsters, potentially. Yeah, I guess. Draw for turn. Planes. Just basics for days. Apparently. I have the opposite problem. <laughs> Don't have a basic yet. And... Swing. Interesting. So... I think I'm obliged to trade... Half of a Thrag Tusk for a Centaur. Am I in Chump territory? I could go to six. Um, I don't think yet. So I'll put him in front of there. Okay. So six, seven? Yeah. Okay. I will take seven. Going to six. Get a beast. And wake the reflections. Yep. <laughs> For when four call of the conclaves is just not enough. <laughs> and yeah, once you have four, you yeah. can well just play wake the reflections as extra copies. Dragon fodder. Ah, uh, okay. Two gobbies. I'm so glad populate isn't like proliferate where it's just <laughs> every token. Every just make a <laughs> copy. Type. I think that was absurd. their original intention, and then they realized that was crazy. Was it really? <laughs> I mean, it's no, it's no doubling season, especially. Can you imagine if? But if there it was, was a, incidentally on yeah. cards that have been nuts. But could you imagine if you if there was a card that was like one green 
and it's just doubling season until end of turn. How nuts that would be. Oh, my God. No. It would be absolutely insane. <laughs> that make that deck so good. Anyway. Draw a card. Hey, a basic! <gasps> and some mountain, your favorite. It's even red. It is. Um, problem is, I don't. Apparently, the one need mountain red in my opening hand is the only one I have. Yeah, I don't really need red. I only need the single red, so it's not a bad thing. Mm-hmm. Uh, God, it sucks. Okay, so. We'll go for a kicked Thornscape Battle Mage. Kicked <gasps> for red. So I'll deal two damage to that. Because it's real. And then we'll also play a Voice of Resurgence. Pass the turn. Untap. Don't think I'm winning this game. Draw for turn. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, you're not winning in this game. Grill War Chant. Oh, okay. Well, I think that just kills me. <laughs> so, attacking creatures I control get plus one, plus oh, and have menace. Yeah, that just kills me. Because I think I'll take eight from this. Swing. Yeah, so... Yeah. So yeah. these are four threes that have to be blocked twice. So, yeah. Two ones that have to so, be blocked. So, yeah, basically, basically, best I can do is, like, <laughs> that. And then I'll take four, five, six, seven, eight. Go to negative two. With giant baiting, which... I kind of wish this was an instant, because it would be sweet. Yeah. But uh, it's not, and I wasn't really on the offensive it's, that game. Yeah. It's, I have a few copies, because they're very nice with Wake Through. Yeah. yeah. And all of a sudden, you just apply Seems 12 pretty good. damage. Seems pretty good. You can conspire it. Yeah. And I didn't really have time to waste on this. I had to put things into play. So, that was game two. And we will see you in game three. All right. Game three. That's what I have. Some pretty fun stuff. Uh, Alright, go ahead. And I've got... Those. Whoop. Okay. I'm going to lead with the Selesnia Guildgate. Pass the turn. And no, I don't have three this time. <laughs> I'm going to leave for the Jungle Shrine. Yours is better. Here we go. Untap. Draw a card. You know what was kind of upsetting? The fact that they didn't have... Uh, was it Maze's End? The card that was like yeah. all the guild gates? Why was that not in this? Because <laughs> you it's could totally draft that deck. It would be interesting to yeah. draft that deck. Anyway. I've always wanted to feature the deck that just does that. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, Snow-Covered Mountain. And we'll go for some exploration. Drawing a card. Wow. <laughs> okay. I'll take it. Slesnia Gilgate. Go ahead. <laughs> <Untap. laughs> After I just said, I don't have three this time. I'll probably end up drawing three. Seaside Citadel. You got it. It's basically Slesnia Gilgate for this deck. More or less. Enter go. <laughs> Dry card. Okay. Now we're in some business, maybe. Um. Wooly. <gasps> Our old friend. It's pretty fast. He's, he's two turns away from getting uh, ground assaulted, at least. Unless you, like, explore and then ground assault. Um, and a snow-covered forest. Go ahead. Untap. So he might get a hit the in. Draw for turn. I mean, he'll probably get blocked by something, but... He'll get to turn sideways, probably. Call of the Conclave. Sure. Enter go. Untap. Draw a card. <laughs> Seriously? Uh, I'm not gonna. This isn't gonna be my land for the turn, <laughs> but I gotta. I gotta show it because I did kind of just say that. Wow. Okay. Um. Humph. I'm gonna take the humph. Okay. <laughs> it's a pretty big humph. Um. Or is that my land for the turn? It might be. Um, yeah, okay. I'll go for a Voice of Resurgence <gasps> and a Slesnia Gilgate. Go ahead. Untap. Draw for turn. Forest. Um. 
Wake the reflections. Sure. Another Fusti. And what is the best choice here? Call of the Conclave. Okay. <laughs> Yet another Fusti. Sure go. Unzap. Draw a card. Okay. I think that's enough of those. Um. Hmm. Humph. Block. A Magma Jet, one of them. Okay. Kind of a two for two, yeah, sort two for of, two. but at least they get to scry. And I get rid of a five four. Yeah. <laughs> um, do I want either of these? I don't think I do. Yeah, I don't think I do. So, bottom. And here's the... a Wayfaring Temple. And I don't think I played a... No, I haven't played a land just turn. So, we'll go for Snow-Covered Mountain. Pass the turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Forest... Wayfaring Temple's just a 2-2? Two -two. Yes. Magma Jetum. Deal. I get a Scry 2. Ha. Huh. Yeah, I think those just stay right on top how they were. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> That's always and... a good thing to hear. We're going to cast Revive. Okay. Turning Call of the Conclave to the hand. <laughs> Man, you love that card. <laughs> Here go. Unzap. Draw a card. That's a decent one. It's Watch Wolf with ridiculous synergy in this deck. It's great. Yeah. Snow covered planes. I guess we'll leave these up. Oop. Like that. Triggity Thrag Tusk. Yeah. Twenty five. Is, is that right? Have you done? You haven't dealt damage to me yet, have you? No. Nope. Yeah. Twenty-five. You kind of had a five-four for a while, so it's true. To... It's true. I did yeah, have the op that. did have the opening salvo. Go ahead. Untap. Draw for turn. A mountain. <laughs> All right. Ground assault him. Ah. Okay. Used to get a beast out of it. And Call of the Conclave. Yep. One doopy. Another doopy. Everyone likes some doopies. Sure go. Untap. Draw a card. Go. Untap. Draw for turn. Call of the Herd. Ugh. Three threes. Yep. Ground assault that. Ah, oh, another one? <laughs> Jesus. Six. Uh, Nineteen. Enter go. Go. Ooh. I mean, it's the foil one, but it still hurts. Untap. Well, when you're drawing... Draw for turn. Amazing removal spells every turn. <laughs> Or three threes, to be fair. Which is your entire deck, so. Flashback call of the herd. Yep. And. Nine. Uh... <laughs> God. It's terrible. Um. But 19. Yeah, I'll chump one. Turn it into an elemental and take 6, going to 13. Enter go. Go. <laughs> well, this um, died really fast. Yeah. 
That it did. Draft turn. And I grew a war chant. Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> 16. Yeah, I'm dead. What was here? A magma jet. <laughs> Yay. Well, that was anticlimactic. That I was thought this was going to be a close game in the first few turns, and then I drew these, yeah, you and you drew those. <laughs> and you drew lands, and I drew spells. All right. Well, that was this. Uh, super, super sealed. sealed. <laughs> or, as it's called commonly on the streets, the Battle of the Three Threes. <laughs> Lots of Three Threes in this particular thing. I was kind of, uh, I was kind of hoping that he would, even if he just came down with, like, no creatures, just so he does something. Be kind of cool. Six a hasty trampler, but, uh, yeah. All right. So, we will see you next week with some stuff. Uh, and I think next Friday is the dual deck. Is that the case? I think so. I think that's the case. If that's true, case, that's yeah. what we'll be doing. So. Yes. All right. See you then. Bye.